All right, or we can just call him Ow. Um, just anyways, call him X. X. I don't know. Call him Ow. Um, Chu is gonna be Defiler. Chu always plays Defiler when they have Defiler, and he's obviously very good at it. Um, and you can virtually rest assured that he's probably gonna be getting that Null Tailsman. I want to. Is it Null Tailsman? Five seconds in vulnerability from physical damage. Probably gonna be Null Tailsman. Void. I don't know. Void Talisman. All right. We're getting closer. Uh, real quick before we got like gank going on down bottom. B kid on swift blade to manage. Okay, you're gonna bound down bottom. Trying to catch blue doing the pull. Okay, they caught. They caught orange. He's gonna go for the block. He's gonna easily get the block, but he didn't actually get the stun on on orange. Orange is free, freely attacking uh, brown now because because uh, behemoth missed that fissure. We got a slow there on warden. The massive damage from uh, from Ow is just really hurting this loaded team right now. Oh wow, a kind of a block right there. All right, all right, all right. Needs to get out of there. He's got not enough. Oh my gosh, the block is gonna work in the wrong favor. Oh, he was able to get out of there. Memories coming by. TSM coming in, cleaning up. Gato returns, comes comes back. I don't know if he TP'd in or if he walked over from from mid. Mid tower went down, by the way. She must have taken that down pretty quick. We got a block. Oh my gosh, what's going on? We got a stun there. One more nice hit. That's a lot of damage there for some reason on uh on purple. It seemed like purple came in there. I think he got two kills. So that's really gonna help his um his blink. Now we've got Hasted Chu coming in, in the from the forest from behind. Let's see what level he is. Level seven is probably gonna pop a Zolt. Maybe try to get a, a tower dive here. I don't know. Just what on the cooldown. hell is he doing? Oh my gosh! He gets the snipe. That's a superior range right there from Defiler. There was not enough mana on a Magmus. Chu was aware of that. He know he knew that he was completely fine with getting in the range of that tower and not getting stunned and taking tower shots. Uh, that's yeah, the good good communication on Lotus part, probably that, or uh, good map awareness. I'd probably say it's great communication there. But wow, this map, this match just is just freaking ridiculous so far. Anyways, I almost finished. Warden, not usually used to babysitting, I'd say. He's our uh, demented shaman. Pig is on Behemoth, and Fuji Apples is on Witch Slayer Radio Man. Anything to say? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out when Plague Rider's gonna buy some boots. Um. He's just got runes of light on this whole game. <laughs> well, we're going to have a leap here for sure if he gets him. There we go. There's the leap down bottom. He's going to use a premature. I did not like that, but it's going to be more than enough anyways as there's four people beating on him. He gets an ult off. Just want to mention that Ow, Orange, uh, Predator, you can easily see, and this is not a European versus American matchup, right? There's no, there's no ping problems here at all. You can easily see a cast coming from Behemoth. Probably didn't need to use that uh, stone hide, you know, wasn't he exactly crucial, but the only thing that he can instacast is actually his ult, which um, he got off anyway, so. Uh, we got sh loaded in the forest, obviously changing their mind, realizing that a uh, 2 is not greater than 4. Gonna get this first tower here, there's no glyph, it's gonna go down. Alright, there we go, nice pushing power there from Jeppin. Kinda, kind of the opposite of Chu, not only in lane, but maybe in skill and also in character, in a hero. Invis Defiler looking for some action by himself here. Nobody knows he's there. Oh, Magmus, do not go that way. Magmus does not want to go that way. Oh, God, he comes out. He silences. He misses his wave. And now he might die. Slow goes down. His friends are definitely close enough, though. Yeah, he's, he's fine. Let's see what he has so far. He's got those phase boots, those ghost marchers to get out of sticky situations. Up top, we got a ping. Have a, we've had a B kid that's uh, free farming up top for a little while now. We need a uh, we need TSM to address that. You definitely do not want a predator free farming. That's definitely not a recommended course of action. Down bottom, though, we've got four from loaded. Trying to get this tower. We're gonna have a push here. We're gonna have an ult most likely from Chu. Chu takes a little bit of damage there from Jeppins. Jeppins takes him right back. <laughs> wow, these guys are so similar in, in uh, hero type. It's almost ridiculous. All right, well, Playgrider still level five. No ulti from him here. That could be a problem. What's yeah. been going on? Is he like 0 and 8 or something? I don't, I don't know. I mean, I think he's been buying a lot of wards here, or at least early game. I think he, yeah, he bought. Courier, he, he winged it as well. So, all and right, well, oh and three. Here we, here goes the push on bottom. We got the the ult from Chu coming out. We still have a glyph. I can't tell if we have a glyph. Uh, they're just gonna let this go. That's probably a wise course of action. As um, it's almost it's almost just as productive to have two up top, just keeping uh, keeping B Kid away from the lane as it is to try and stop that team fight down bottom. So, B Kid. Uh, uh, you know, he's just doing nothing but watching his lane right now. He's gonna need some help though from his friends, and there's no tower to TP to, so 
He's going to be out of that lane for a little while now. No ult from Defiler means uh, they're obviously going to back off now. That going to have having pushed the lane, that's going to be an even nicer free farm there for for Al. Didi going to be bottled there by Chu. Now they do have wards. They should have noticed that everybody did not leave. Uh, actually, they saw three out of the four leave, so they know they're safe to farm down there. Now let me check out the golden minutes here for the respective carries. Being, um, I'm going to pretend Chu is not a carry, even though pretty much whatever he plays is a carry. Uh, let's talk about B Kid and and Al. Al working with 206 gold a minute, not not too shabby. B Kid with 270, much nicer and pretty impressive, honestly, this early on. You cannot count out the uh, carry that is Puppet Master as well, though. So. Um, I'd say the late game potential for each team is pretty massive, to be honest. Lots of late gamers here. Yeah, Behemoth's almost got his Blink Dagger 2 here. Magmus is struggling with it. Really, Magmus struggling with his Blink. He had a couple kills there. Maybe, um... Maybe he went other items in the meantime. Yeah, he got boots and finished his Yeah, yeah, supply. like, you've got, you've got Pig here, our Behemoth. He just... All he has pretty much is Bottle. And a Mana Battery. He's definitely not trying to run out of Mana. We got a... DD here on Chu. How long is that DD for? Another five seconds. Gonna get a couple hits in here. They're gonna go again here. Definitely making use of this Defiler. Are they gonna make a stand here? I I, I doubt it. Yeah, no. Jep Jepins is mid. There's no point. Yeah, Jepin. But uh, the glyph. Did the glyph already go down? Oh gosh. Nice. 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 Is he fast enough to get the kill on Jepins? He is easily fast enough. Did they get the tower though? They at least they did get the tower. Yeah, he did. But um, nice play there by B Kid. Obviously realizing that um. If he just runs at him, he's going to run away, and he's going to run away from his creep support. He's going to be able to soak up an entire ult. But at least they're doing what they can. You know, they're not... Oh, wow. Nice gank. I caught that up top. Hopefully, uh, hopefully, Calneon did as well. But what happened, Witchlayer, he was hiding off to the left in the in the forest, and it, had, it kind of looked like Warden was just soloing the lane or something. He came up, but we have Fuji Apples in trouble. He gets a nice stun there on, on Sal. A nice ult there from a plague, though. We'll be able to finish him off. One of them's gonna get away. The other one goes down. Jesus, this this game is just ridiculous. Um, even match so far, though. I mean, um, pretty yeah. close. Pretty pretty close. Same towers, roughly the same hero kills. I like how TSM is responding though to the pushes from uh, from the five man pushes. They're they're making pushes of their own. I guess they feel as if they're not ready to win these team fights yet, so they're they're giving these towers to loaded. Meanwhile, uh, they're letting Jepins kind of answer back and take his own towers, and it's working. Okay, I guarantee in like five minutes time, this behemoth pig, he's got his blink now. You're gonna see TSM get surprised here with a blink alt. Yeah, it's gonna be huge when Behemoth gets this ult. But then again. I mean, TSM hasn't even bothered to have a team fight yet, so it's like, when is he even going to be able to use this? But uh, let's see how close Purple is, like you were saying. He's kind of behind. He's got 800, almost 900. I think he doesn't have a bottle either. He chose to go a power supply. Honestly, Green's just farming more than period, I would say. Definitely. Yeah, he's got like 60 gold per minute up on him. Uh, loaded, loaded here, definitely on a mission. You can tell they, they're all four together always. Meanwhile, B Kid farming away up top, gonna carry this hard form late game. Um, and I like the makeup. I, li I like how the the team fights are gonna work out in their favor here eventually because Chu forces the team fight. Obviously, the team fight that Pig wants for his ult. Um, with Fuji apples, you know, he's just your he's just your versatile burst damage disabler. They're gonna get some of these some of these dragons under the belt before uh, before they choose to push again. Well, as you can see, there's not a lot of map control in the favor here for TSM. Uh, pretty much complete map control for... Although they did see Brown go in there by himself. I wonder if they're going to do anything about that now. There's a ward. Pretty uncommon ward. Um, at least that I've seen thus far in Han. Obviously, very common ward in Dota time, but haven't seen it used too much. All right, well, here is again the push from Loaded on top now. 